Hey everybody, welcome to my channel. In this video, today I'm going to show you how to count cells that contain a specific um, word. Okay, I'm using Google um, Google Sheets. So here we go. So I have two um, lists of words here. This, this, this column here contains a series of words in each cell. And this cell contains, this column contains words, just single words. Okay, so I'm going to start with column C. Right, we're going to, we're going to count um, the words that are repetitive um, in column C, the number of them, the amount they have in um, in this particular column, right? So um, what we're going to do, I'm going to do a formula. And the first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to put in the equal sign, the word count, count if. This is a condition statement, right? Open commas, parentheses, sorry, open brackets, parentheses, right? And we're going to um, say, say the range of what we want to do this um, count um, formula. So we're just going to enter from here and come down this range here. And then I'm going to put a comma. And the criteria, criteria is I'm looking for the word Trinidad. So I'm going to put open quotation marks, Trinidad, type the word Trinidad, close quotation marks, and then close parentheses. Okay? Right, and right away we can see here the result is showing up right here. You see it here says number two, it's saying number two. So let's double check that manually. There's one here and there's one here. Now you notice right away that I, um, this is not case sensitive because I have the word Trinidad in lowercase, all the letters in lowercase, right? Now these words Trinidad here has a capital T in it. So as you can see here, it doesn't matter. Um, it doesn't matter if they have any capitals or lowercase um, letters in the word. Um, it will pick up the word as long as it's as long as it qualifies to what's in this brackets here. So I'm just going to press enter. I'm going to see the results here. We have two um, two two cells with the word Trinidad. So there's one here, like we said before, another one, like we said before. Okay, that's one way we could do it. Now we're going to get a little more complicated here. We're using this set of data here. Now, as you can see here, most of the contents in these cells has like two words, this has like three words. And we're going to do a search for looking for the word virgin. There's one here, one here, one here, right? And as you can see here, this one has a capital V, this one has all its lower keys. So um, the formula is similar, but just a slight difference. So we're going to put the equal sign again, another formula, equal sign, sorry, equal sign, count, if, um, open parentheses, I'm going to highlight the area we want to do the search on. So that's from B3 to B10. And then we're going to put a comma. Open open parentheses. And this time we're going to just, just going to put, we're going to put, um, sorry, open quotation marks, sorry. We're going to put, and then I'll put the asterisk and um, virgin. Asterisk again, close parentheses. Close quotation marks, why am I getting mixed up? And close parentheses. And as, as we see like before, we're going to see the result here, three of them. I'm going to press enter. Number three. So as we have, we have one here, virgin here, virgin here, virgin here. Okay, guys, I hope this is clear to you. If you have any questions, please free to leave it in the comment section below if you want any clarification. Or if you'd like me to do another video on um, Google Sheets tutorial, I'm happy to accommodate you as best as I can. If you enjoyed this video, click on the thumbs up button, leave a comment for me, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. And don't forget to click on the bell next to the subscribe button. In doing so, you'll get a notification each time I upload a new video. Okay, thanks for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.